बोला की कॉलेज मध्य बर एक विचार तुम्हें टीपीओ मैं अप्रूव होते हैं हो हो कॉल मैं तुम्हें संगित मैं प्रोसेस कर वॉट्सअपला हो 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 नंबर भांबरे सर ना हो लगे पाठ तुम्हें सर ओके now uh, we'll start with the break analysis uh, break even analysis as we all know that it is related to the profit and loss of the particular industrial product it means that uh, whatever be the product which we are going to manufacture whether at which stage it will come for the profit and at which stage it come from uh, uh, for the loss case that we are going to decide as a design engineer or production uh, industrial product design engineer will have to design or uh, decide which will be the break even point and according to that we have approach uh, to the development of the product that's why here you can see just write down the heading break down break even analysis break even analysis so just write down the decision making add that enable a manager to determine whether the particular volume of sale will result in loss or profit will result in loss or profit so here we are going to understand at which stage of our industrial product is going to affect or it is in profit that we are going to define just write down that definition okay now see here in case of the break even analysis actually what happened so here how it comes to know that whether uh, profit or loss will be there so see i have quoted uh, the points the break even analysis is related with the three kinds of the uh, parameters first one is a fixed cost in which you can uh, say that that cost will not be changed it is fixed then variable cost it can be changed as per the condition so that we called as a variable cost condition means if suppose my plant is here development product development plant is in pune so uh, in that area i will have to sell that particular product in a reasonable cost if my product is going for uh, or uh, sell in tamil nadu or south region or north region in that case the traveling allowance and all that things so because of that our my cost of the product is increased so that we called as a variable cost it can be changed revenue revenue means what as per the total outcome which we have created according to that how much amount of the income is received that we called as a revenue and profit profit is nothing but whatever be the product we have developed on the basis of that product how much amount of revenue is generated that we called as a profit therefore they have mentioned the money you have after subtracting fixed and variable cost so there is a difference in between fixed and variable cost that will create a revenue and that converted into profit 
so just write down these three uh, parameters fixed cost variable cost revenue and profit just write down fixed variable and revenue Four. Yes, sir. Okay. Now, next parameter is related to the break-even analysis. How we can make the analysis? So, as I told you, the four variables: fixed cost is there, variable cost is there. Now, volume of the output. Volume means how many numbers of quantity. Suppose in a one day we are preparing ten components. So. we'll have to consider the volume according to the days multiplied by the production rate so that we called as a x and p is nothing but whatever be the decided price per unit now the formulation is px it means total price or total volume created by the particular company for the product is equal to fixed cost plus variable cost related to the per unit understood so this will be the formula and through which we are able to calculate the point suppose i am producing uh, water bottles so in that water bottles i must know what should be the break even analysis so what should be the break even analysis so break even analysis suggested that while preparing suppose i am preparing the bottle and it has having cost of 5 rupees per bottle and i am uh, uh, and uh, as a designer i must know how much amount of the quantity i should sell so that i'll get the profit or i'll start the profit from that particular point so that will be called as a break even analysis so just write down this formula px is equal to fixed cost plus variable cost with respect to number of units number of units just write down this okay then you can see this we called as a break even analysis chart the chart is related with the quantity with respect to output a quantity as the number of units with respect to output now here what we you can say see this will be the red line indicate the cost so cost of the particular product we have decided and according to that it will work now as per the sale we must know what should be the income so this straight line uh, blue color straight line indicate the income line so that will be the point a or a line we can say now where this income line as well as cost line meet that we called as a break even point and that break even point suggested if whatever with the product i have developed that can be sell through this point or above this point or beyond this point that we called as a profit comes uh, profit will be start see here point p is the uh, point break even point above which will get the profit you can see here profit and below which if i if my sale of the product is below this then i am in loss so i must know at which point profit will start so this we point will have to create before or while developing the product so we must know what should be the cost what what should be the profit and when i get the profit so that we called as a break even analysis point so just draw this or else uh, another diagram also i have given you can see here what this indicates see uh, number of sales or units with respect to units sold you can see here the again the blue color line is related with the profit and 
the loss region is below this point so and there is a fixed variable and total cost so fixed cost line constant line variable cost line variable line and total cost line with respect to fixed cost so that will be the things and here is the points will get the cut with the income line so yacha atle je kay asel so that we called as a loss and below this or above this we'll have to say that it is a profit understood so you can draw both the diagram which would be the suitable i think this will be the better understanding you can draw profit and loss that is a important one for the break even analysis So also और प्रतीक्षा Yes, sir. Okay. Now, next point is uh, now we'll have to see uses of break-even analysis. Of course, use is very important as a designer or as a developer or as a manufacturer of the product. We are able to decide what should be the profit and what should be the loss. That is the best uh, use of this uh, break-even analysis. So here, a uh, few point I have quoted. It is helpful for deciding minimum quantity of sale. so that i can get the profit minimum quantity kiti karala pahije te kale or maximum quantity quantity me jar develop keli so what should be the profit point that i'll get so second point it will help to determine the price also tender price tender means what somewhere we are taking the contract and while taking the contract we'll have to give them the price list or whatever the total price so that price also we can define according to uh, manufacturing now it can be helpful for effect on the organization profitability suppose organization is preparing 100 components per day and if as a development of the product or if i get the break even point from the analysis i decided to go for 150 component per day then definitely organize organization will be in a profit or we can decide if the parts are defective or it has having some porosity or it has having some defects then it can be comes to the loss point so that also we can define it is also helpful for substitution of new plant new plant means what suppose i am developing the products component but i have decided that in a my, in a single plant it is not possible to develop uh, amount of the uh, component which we have decided for, for the profit so we have not uh, for that we we are able to think for the new plan therefore the branches of the various things are available in pune you can see the tata motor is having four to five branches why because they have decided the plan and according to the capability they have uh, developed or manufacture the components it is also helpful for sales price of course quantity and sales price and determine the marginal cost marginal means what whichever be the spent while developing that at least cost will have to consider or which will have to get from the manufacturing 
that we called as a manufacturing or marginal cost so you can write down the break even analysis point the few points i have mentioned here the proper usage of that break even analysis just write down you just message me when you have uh, written these things uses of break even point which will decide the profit or loss few kind of uses 1 2 3 4 you, in this manner you can write over yes sir okay now few assumptions are there no need to write from your end i'll just read it because you understand the understanding of the concept is very important because our paper is not going to become a theoretical point of view so i'll read here the assumptions of course the whatever be the four cost we have consider as like see here fixed cost variable cost volume and price everywhere the fixed cost will have to consider as a constant rate variable cost will have to consider the variable rate and the volume of the quantity also it is a constant so because of the constant value what will happen uh, suppose i am manufacturing the product and while manufacturing product the uh, management told me that you will have to manufacture the 150 product so i have decided to go for 150 and the uh, here after developing the 150 or after selling 150 we realize that the profit is start break even point is crack and we are going beyond this so at that time we'll have to take a suggestion from the management will it go for the 200 component per day manufacturing or not so that is the things if we can uh, consider uh, early time or before development of the product this much amount of the product we'll have to develop then there will be the chances of the profit but because of this assumptions will take the time for the profit so here you can see all the cost total cost of the consider or variable cost semi variable cost we can ignore the cost and revenue function remain linear linear means constant the fixed cost remain constant over the volume correct so likewise things are assumptions will have to consider therefore practically break even analysis we can not cal uh, sorry theoretically we cannot uh, calculate correctly because of the assumptions okay ha tacha slide cha heto now limitations are there limitation as i told you we cannot predict how much amount of the component will have to produce we'll have to decide after production correct before production it is not possible and that is the major uh, limitation for the break even analysis now these are few points uh, i have quoted here so the conclusion of the break even analysis i'll say it is a simple tool which helps to determine the profit or loss of the particular or new product development case though according to uh, the nature according to price according to volume according to variable cost we we'll have to decide so you just write down this point conclusion conclusion for break even analysis conclusion in case of the break even analysis it is the simple tool which helps to decide the profit as well as loss while developing the product while manufacturing the product okay that will be the first point second point 
break even analysis helps to calculate how much amount of sell we need to uh, and for that uh, how much amount of the quantity will have to develop very simple and these are the fact factors fixed cost variable cost volume price now here i have quoted one example and very simple example through which you will realize what should be the break even analysis point so see example let us say you can see a burger uh, we are developing a burger suppose example and it cost of 1 rupees for making a development cost or manufacturing cost 1 rupees hai 1 dollar le lete hain theek hai 1 dollar theek hai so then variable cost of the burger while selling change hote rahte pratyek ke chat kiti 2.80 dollar so that will be the variable cost and we are decided to develop the product about 1 lakh dollar per month asa apan fixed cost cha point of view decide kelela hai kay hota 1 rupya cost hai त्याची कॉस्ट व्हेरिएबल दोन पॉईंट ऐंशी आहे आणि एक एक लाख डॉलर पर्यंत आपल्याला पोहोचायचं आहे तर काय करताय सो ऍज पर द फॉर्म्युलेशन यू कॅन सी व्ही इज नथिंग बट व्हेरिएबल कॉस्ट पी इज नथिंग बट पर युनिट प्राईस विच इज व्हेरी इज टू पॉईंट एट झिरो अँड द फिक्स प्रोडक्शन किती आपल्याला करायचं आहे एक लाख डॉलरचं सो अवर टार्गेट इज वन लाख डॉलर सो फॉर दॅट पर्पज वॉट शुड बी द ब्रेक इव्हन पॉईंट सी एक्स इज इक्वल टू एफ फिक्स कॉस्ट डिवायडेड बाय पी मायनस व्ही सो थाउजंड डॉलर मायनस टू पॉईंट एट झिरो सॉरी डिवायडेड बाय टू पॉईंट एट झिरो मायनस वन सो हिअर आय गेट एक्स इज इक्वल टू फिफ्टीन फॉर फिफ्टी फाय थाउजंड फाय 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 करेक्ट फाय हंड्रेड फिफ्टी फाय सो इट मीन्स दॅट माय ब्रेक इव्हन अनालिसिस ऑफ द बर्गर ॲटलिस्ट म्हणजे प्रॉफिट मला कधी चालू होईल जेव्हा मी पंचावन्न हजार पाचशे पंचावन्न बर्गर्स मी सेल करेन तेव्हापासून माझं प्रॉफिट चालू होईल सो लाईक वाईज वी कॉल्ड ॲज अ ब्रेक इव्हन अनालिसिस पॉईंट याला म्हणतात ब्रेक इव्हन पॉईंट हे कळालं का रे हितेश प्रियंका प्रतीक्षा हा सर ठीक आहे सो दिस विल बी द ब्रेक इव्हन अनालिसिस सो यू कॅन राईट डाऊन दिस एक्स इज इक्वल टू गेप बाय दिस वी इज द व्हेरिएबल कॉस्ट पी इज द पर युनिट प्राईस एफ इज द फिक्स्ड इट इज इन डॉलर वी कॅन मेक इन रुपीज ऑल्सो नो प्रॉब्लेम this is just an example just write down likewise we'll have to use while manufacturing the things in this manner okay now see this is just an example you can take as a homework uh, while uh, studying घ्यायची गरज नाही सध्या नाव आन्सर आय हॅव कोटेड नाव इकॉनॉमिक अनालिसिस नेक्स्ट हेडिंग राईट डाऊन इकॉनॉमिकल अनालिसिस व्हेरी सिम्पल इकॉनॉमिकल अनालिसिस नाव इन केस ऑफ द इकॉनॉमिक्स अनालिसिस सी इकॉनॉमिक्स मीन्स हाऊ मच अमाऊंट ऑफ द कॉस्ट शुड इन्क्लूड वाईल डेव्हलपिंग द प्रोडक्ट अँड how much amount of the cost is required to market that product it means for the marketing purpose publicity or we'll have to make the ad ads so how much amount of the cost will be required that we called as a economic analysis as i told you in previous session micro and macro analysis same function we'll have to use but here the constraints are we'll have to maintain uh, how we can uh, buy that or purchase that product either it is in physically or physical manner in which the fixed amount will have to consider or it is related to time related time related means seasonal huh? seasonal it is seasonal and the financial financial means the limited amount of resources such, such as 
you can say amazon flipkart so that will be the financial uh, points are there because whatever be the uh, amazon and uh, these products are there they are taking the charges of the developer uh, for adding and the things uh, which showing for uh, a particular product now institutional so institutional means some institutional or some companies are uh, developing the product it has to mention is policies and regulation it is not like that nearby the company copied the things koni yun copy karun pudha chalel asa nahi hot so that's why that policy and regulation will have to consider and for that costing is required and that comes under economic analysis so this is about just economic analysis uh, uh, already we have discussed in previous session now next point we'll have to learn about fast method have you heard about fast method वाचले का ऐकले तुम्ही प्रतीक्षा हितेश हॅव यू हर्ड अबाउट फास्ट मेथड टेल मी हितेश कॅन यू टेल मी प्रतीक्षा कॅन यू नो ओके आय विल एक्सप्लेन फास्ट मेथड वाईल डेव्हलपिंग द प्रोडक्ट ऍज आर ऍज आय टोल्ड यू आर सेकंड युनिट इज रिलेटेड विथ द कस्टमर सॅटिस्फॅक्शन नीड ऑफ द कस्टमर अँड इट्स कन्सेप्ट फॉर द सॅटिस्फॅक्शन सो ऑफकोर्स फास्ट मेथड इज हेल्पफुल फॉर डेव्हलपिंग द प्रॉडक्ट विथ द बेस्ट क्वालिटी इन अ लेस टाइम therefore fast long form is c f for function a for analysis s for system and t for technique functional analysis system techniques it means it will provide the proper quality or good quality within a less time with the respect to various by using various techniques that we called as a fast method now there are the various parameter how we can think about this fast method i'll quote one example over here suppose i'm using milling machine uh, uh, drilling machine boring machine so each machine has separate separate machine and situated at a particular space so uh, particular uh, distance so suppose i want to do the first milling so i'll do the milling process it will take a uh, half an hour then after that i remove that part and i come to the drilling process so i'll drill wherever uh, as per the design so for that again it required half an hour again i'll go for the boring process and in that boring the boring tools are there arrangement is there and again it will take half an hour so totally if we calculate around 2 to 3 hours it will require to complete the process but instead of that why not to use a single machine which can perform these three function very easily that we called as a fast method and it will reduce the time instead of 2 to 3 hours it will require half an hour for overall product development so that we called as a fast method so just write down the title fast method long form la so that apan pudu jau fast method now see it one by one as i quoted example the lakshya theva function analysis system technique now what is function analysis system techniques so whatever i told you same a technique to develop a graphical representation which shows a logical relation between a function of the project product process me process cha example dile or service based question like why how you can say wh question when what how so likewise question will have to ask while developing and that will result in a fast method so here they have mentioned one example suppose information reader it means researcher or developer he will have to think how we, i how i can develop the product first thing why i should develop the product second thing and when i should launch that product third thing so these three things he should have to understand or he should have to keep in mind so that this fast technique will work 
ठीक है सो राइट डाउन दस ब्लॉक डायग्राम तुम्हें ड्रॉ करा वर से तीन लाइन लिया ज्या की इंडिकेट करता कि फास्ट मेथड का है तो जस्ट राइट डाउन फास्ट दैट इज फंक्शन एनालिस सीस्टीम टेक्निक ओवर व्यवस्थित लिखुन गया मेन मेन पॉइंट अपन लिव कारण स्लाइड्स आई एम गोइंग टू शेयर यू सो नो नीड टू राइट ऑल द थिंग्स जस्ट वील हैव टू राइट विच एवर बी द इम्पॉर्टेंट वाइल स्टडिंग और वाइल मेकिंग रिविजन इट इज इजी फॉर युअर पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू ना नेक्स्ट यार आवाज ये ना बाढ़ के तुम लिहन प्रतीक्षा हाँ ये तो सर ठीक नाउ सी व्हाई द फंक्शन व्हाई फास्ट एनालिस इज इम्पॉर्टेंट बिकॉज see if i am not using this techniques or new developed technology then it will take me again long time for development again 
the profit will reduced and unnecessarily time is wasted on a product development by the workers machines electricity so these things are wasted so that's why fast analysis is important now these are the few benefits first benefits develop the shared understanding of the project of course kashi process hai kay hai kasa develop karal pahije second identify the missing function missing function means which are the function which are actually missing in the development suppose uh, you are preparing the casting and there is a porosity will be developed so that porosity how to avoid that will be the missing concept that will have to follow correct so second third define and simplicity and clarify the problem because of this fast techniques it gives the organize or understand the relation between the functions it will also identify the basic functions of the basic process of the product development it will improve the communication and consensus communication means what the communication in between various department it means design department develop the model production department manufacture the model correct so that will be the communication should be there whatever the changes are there that should be communicated by the design department to the production department and accordingly so it means the communication between the various departments of the industry which are involved for the product development and lastly stimulate the creativity creativity means what the new things which will have to create and which will get the benefit for the product so these are the benefits so write down 1 2 3 4 benefits for fast analysis after uh, completion of this you can write uh, the message over uh, or written the things so that will start the next point okay so i hope over this so these are the benefits now here uh, i have mentioned the function here uh, we'll have to consider the wh question why when and how so that we'll have to consider for the designing the product or development of the product now here i have quoted one example these are the steps how to develop suppose designer will design the things then we'll have to decide the process by the manufacturer then development then production then packaging so that will be the steps now here i have quoted one example related to the mouse trap so this is the machine which helps to develop the mouse trap undir undir pakadaychi machine ahe so here what happened so the various things are there the mechanism is available so it is not like that we'll have to move 
uh, run to uh, the mouse and uh, capture them no so we'll have to arrange the machine so that here while developing the machine this will be the fast diagram which which will helps to uh, grab or catch the mouse very easily so this is just an example here also it include the wh question why how and how, uh, how we can develop so accordingly we'll have to develop this machine so you can quote any example so this is about the fast method fast theek hai he samajh laga pratiksha okay now next will be the information gathering for product development write down information gathering for product development 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 now as a developer or as a product manufacturer we we'll have to collect the information it is not like that we have decided to develop the product and we have started the developing no we we'll have to survey the things we we'll have to collect the information for development of the particular product as like you can see we we'll have to consider the things we we'll have to survey the market we we'll have to arrange the event so that we'll get the present situation we'll have to arrange the press release of course this press release arrange after development we'll have to decide the plan we'll have to decide the logo we'll have to decide the executive execute executive team which will be work on the particular information gathering committee we'll have to decide the price of the particular uh, component which we are going to develop or existing component co compare with the existing component correct we'll have to decide the location where it is feasible to develop the plant or develop the uh, component so these are the various things and these are the in internet things as like twitter facebook community mails so these are helps facebook so these are helps for uh, promotion of the product through online in a less cost so that will be the consideration for the information gathering here we'll have to focus on the competitive research manje ka existing product jana develop kela hai kyun hua the product development ko kyun hua existing product sa manufacturer what changes he has done what development parameters he has consider that we must know before development or before innovation so that we called as a competitor research correct so it comes under market survey also correct so just write down uh, information gathering by the competitor research so these are the various uh, components for competitive research then customer survey is also important in case of the customer survey what happened while well, deciding the things whether that customer is satisfied for the previous product or not as i have quoted previously also one example currently the pleasure i think bike is there uh, for which uh, the lights are always on two wheeler bike so that will be the drawbacks so another company two wheeler manufacturer ladies uh, manufacturer ladies two wheeler manufacturing company will have to think over that will have to decide the condition because the whichever be the existing product launch is not that much suitable or that uh, customer are not that much comfortable with that so that the developer or new product developer he will have to think this parameter and he will have to give the additional feature so that customer can satisfy so that whatever be the launching of the product after that the feedback session is there through that feedback will get idea what are the lacunas or what are the flaws in the development of the product he apan tachatun find out karu shakto manun customer survey ha mahatvacha ahe आणि कस्टमर सर्वे आज प्रोडक्ट लॉन्च केला लगेच उद्या असं नाही होत कस्टमर सर्वे विल कॅप्चर ऑर विल गेट आफ्टर वन टू टू मंथ ऑफ लॉन्चिंग करेक्ट देन वी आर फॅमिलियर दॅट विच एव्हर बी द कस्टमर युजिंग दॅट दॅट आर कम्फर्टेबल ऑर नॉट 
uh, whatever be the suggestions from uh, his or her side that will have to consider that called that called as a customer survey clear next point is we must know the customer visit customer visit is the very important point suppose uh, i am developing one particular product and uh, some few faculties uh, from the out of the countries are visiting for that particular plant now after visiting they will give the suggestions so this kind of the generation or this process will be wrong you can use by this way and so on so whatever be the suggestions comes from the customer visit for from the renowned persons or renowned personality that will have to consider for the development or further development and according to that will have to make the changes that we called as a customer visit for gathering of the information correct our point is gathering information while developing the product so these things are there after that so these are the basic things after that uh, lot many things are there you can search on google search on net whatever the current scenario you can visit to the as a customer to the particular development industry and ask them how it can be you can uh, raise the questions over there through that also you will get the idea so this comes under gathering of the information for the particular product while developing the product so here i mentioned identify the customer determine the customer need that is very important priority ka hai tacha that is also important after that identification of the customer beyond the end user uh, whether the in involvement of the technical staff uh, uh, marketing strategy for that will required then determine the customer needs through uh, survey interview focus focus group focus group manje kay particular area thle group apan uh, tacha feedback geto and sort according to priority base ami manje kay ekada sorting asel kiwa color changla nahi so that is not saglyancha to answer kiwa feedback kela asa sangta yet nahi so tela priority dene peksha kai tar technical uh, innovation apan tacha taku shakto to ya paddhatine apan information ya gather karto understood samajla kare pratiksha have you understood yes sir okay so this we called as a information gathering ek chhota sa bit hota to mi explain kela after that feasibility analysis ha tumcha point hai feasibility analysis means what feasible means the part which is able to do or perform the work in a particular time that we called as a feasibility so that is feasibility so here is the first stage feasibility study analysis of the vari uh, viability of an idea through a disciplined and documented process manje kay dilela time nusar te particular product he kaam karnar that we called as a feasibility correct so and that product should work in the basis of various condition that is called as feasibility example wind turbines are not feasible in rainy season that is feasibility why because because of the rainy season the flow will not capture by the blade and it will not rotate so that we called as a feasibility understood now the feasibility study so few points i'll uh, read here feasibility study evaluate the project potential for the success of course whether that feasible or not as the particular condition because see uh, if i am using solar power plants in shadow area that is not feasible it will not capture the sun rays so according to that we we'll have to decide the feasibility now here few points they have quoted what feasibility study is an analysis of the viability of the an idea it ensure that the project is legally and technically feasible and economically justice justifiable taras to launch kiwa taras to development la ketla jato kahi tari idea chandra var jayche mala ani mi tasa machin tayar karto तर दैट इज नॉट दैट मच फिजिबल अंडरस्टूड तेला टेक्नोलॉजी लगे तेला रेफरेंस लगे तेला तुम्स बॉन्डिंग पाजे तुम्हें कुछ तरह काम के पाजे तो सैक्शन मे एंड सो ऑन सो दैट्स वाई दिस वी कॉल्ड एज अ फिजिबिलिटी नाउ फिजिबिलिटी स्टडी ऑलवेज फोकस ऑन प्रैक्टिकल एंड आइडिया अकॉर्डिंग टू द आइडेंटिफाइड प्रॉब्लम्स अफकोर्स नाउ नेक्स्ट विन बेनिफिट ऑफ फिजिबिलिटी अफकोर्स इफ वी डिसाइड द फिजिबिलिटी दैट बेनिफिट टू डेवलपमेंट ऑफ द प्रोजेक्ट वेरी इजीली Uh, get the new things very easily and through which we'll have to develop the decision making property also 
so these are the basic benefits while developing the feasibility then overview as per the syllabus technical feasibility they have considered quoted and is, there are many more types of the feasibility ja mi lile operational feasibility aste economical feasibility ahe marginal feasibility ahe schedule feasibility ahe ani social yachatla apan as a engineering point of view apan technical feasibility focus karto karan syllabus madhe dile so technical feasibility means what the machines are there component availability is there space availability is there the process availability is there to and fro process will be there uh, the traveling uh, should be there so that be called as a feasibility samjha mi part asa design karto ki and develop karto hai jacha vazan 1 ton ahe to tyacha sathi mala chhota chhota cars madun te janan nahi to feasible kay rahel truck volvos bus kiwa tractors ya type chi feasibility apan technical machine एका जागेवरून दुसऱ्या जागेला नेण्यासाठी आपण करू शकतो सो दॅट बी कॉल्ड एज अ टेक्निकल फिजिबिलिटी अव्हेलेबिलिटी ऑफ टूल्स समजा एखादा पार्ट मी मॅन्युफॅक्चर करतोय आणि त्याचे टूल्स आहेत बरेच लांब आहेत बरं त्याला यायला चार दिवस लागतात सो इट इज नॉट इट्स ऑफ नॉट यूज सो ती टेक्निकल फिजिबिलिटी होत नाही सो दीज आर द कम्पोनंट वाय डेव्हलपिंग द प्रोडक्ट विच एवर विद लॅकून अज आर देअर अँड थ्रू विच द फॉल्ट और प्रॉब्लेम विल ऑकर दॅट comes under the feasibility okay so technical feasibility te mi dile mi atta sangitle tes lile deni technical feasibility is assessment focused on present technical resources available in the organization resources ahet ka available asel tar thik nasel tar purchase karne joge ahet ka purchase kele tar easily available hotil ka ya sagle consideration apan ghetle pahije it is it studied if the technical resources including a technical team are capable to convert their idea into the working with the help of existing material with the help of existing machines tar tela technical feasibility mhantat it is also evaluate the hardware and software required for the proposed system so it is a part of designing engineering so whether your manufacturer is totally different or design and development is will be in under uh, one umbrella of a single plant so if it is so that will be the technical feasible it is not like that we design it kele development la tikade nele tithe problem ale titna tanni parat correction dila yanni correction kela ma tithe gele parat te correction match jhale nahi par so it will time consuming process so that's why feasibility is important so technical feasibility la size of the plant important location of the project pollution ya sagla goshti mi tumhala sangitle le so that technically feasible apan check karto emergency cha kay provision ahet material handling kasa hota cranes ahet ka lifts ahet ka nahi tar paach majle chi company ahe ani tela chalat jay lagta every times aplyala to product uchlun var nay lagto nahi chalnar that should not come under technical feasibility understood now the primary risk for the technical feasibility of course manpower kiti lagte he saglyat mahatvache resources kiti lagtat design parameter kiti lagtat he sudha tevdas mahatvache alternatives kay ahet design la te pan bagayla pahije choices of available technologies cost ya saglya goshti technical feasibility madhe consider kela jatat ani magas decide kela jata now the main component manufacturing technology me technology badal bollu now ek example me quote karto so that you will understand what is the technical feasibility you can see uh, earlier the agriculture field uh, likewise things are there uh, for the uh, building the uh, crop correct so this was the arrangement and it will required number of uh, people persons so you can see around uh, 10 to 15 uh, persons are working over there correct so that can be minimized by the technical feasibility with the help of machine so you can see one machine crop the grass very easily with a single person so that we called as a agriculture field technical feasibility so likewise things are there in case of the technical feasibility ya sagle agriculture che point of view machineries mi taklele ja ki human effort vachavta ani unnecessarily time reduce karta correct so this we called as a technical feasibility in the field of machine section or agriculture section have you understood this pratiksha
प्रतीक्षा यस सर कळालं का हे सगळं हो सर ठीक चाल सो राईट नाऊ टेन थर्टी इज देअर अराउंड सो शाल बी स्टॉप इयर प्रतीक्षा ओके सर ठीक चाल